What's up, guys? Oh, welcome to my channel. I am just Jen. That's me. Hi. So listen, it has been a hot minute since I've done a pentatonix video. I know, you guys. If you knew, <laughs> if you only knew, I'm a single mother. I have a toddler. I have a kid going off to college. Like, any day. A couple weeks, actually. So it's... I'm trying to run my own YouTube channel. I'm trying to do all of this stuff by myself. And it's like, ah! But anyhow, uh, this is uh, Pentatonix, Married Did You Know. And, you know, I, I've heard this song uh, played in my home while growing up. My, this is probably one of my grandmother's favorite songs. And um, I grew up in an uh, Italian-American family, Catholic family. And I've never seen this video before, and I've never heard Pentatonix cover it. So I'm very interested to see this. You guys have mentioned it countless times. Uh, when are you going to do another Pentatonix reaction? Right now. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, guys, please do me the honor. Please tap that subscribe button if you had, if you would, please. Next to the notification bell, make sure you tap the all button so you're notified when I'm live or drop a new video like this. Speaking of likes, make sure you hit that like button for me. Leave them comments because I love talking to all of you. I love all your suggestions. Uh, Pentatonix, great acapella band, and this is a very, very uh, religious song. It's beautiful, actually beautiful. Do this, huh? Oh, oh, and there is Mitch. Mitch is in the video still. This is this must have been released a while before Mitch had departed ways. And even you guys said he left on amicable terms, even helped find a replacement for him. Uh, this was released in 2014. Holy cannoli. Seven years ago. Wow, almost seven years. Wait a second here. Wait a second here. November 11th, 2014. 10 days after I uh, got sober for the first time. My sobriety date is uh, November 1st, 2014. I'll tell you more about that and uh, if you'd like to hear it, I actually did an addiction special. Mary, did you know that your baby boy would save our sons and daughters? Did you know come to make you new this child that you delivered will soon deliver you whoa now like i said i grew up in an italian american household very catholic my grandmother and my great grandmother who actually came from italy uh would say <laughs> she would say the rosary for hours and hours and you know what they were good people and without getting into it uh more painful memories for me it's a good memory for me and you know my great my grandmother used to tuck me in to bed at night and I would have to say, the All Father. <sighs> Did you know that your baby boy will give sight to a blind man? Mary, did you know that your baby boy will calm the storm with his head? Wow. 
This is so powerful. <laughs> I just, you know, I will never make fun of somebody for believing in God or whatever you believe in. It's not right. It's not right to do. Uh, you know, it, this is a very, very emotional song as well because, you know, a lot of people, they are religious. They do believe. They do have faith. And if that makes them happy, what does that matter? It doesn't. It shouldn't apply. If if you don't believe, it shouldn't apply to you. Let it go. Let it fly. You know, I think this is a very beautiful song. And this is uh, put together very well. And they are singing this so beautifully. Uh, the fact that they're a cappella, it really does make it that much more beautiful. There's no instruments involved. It's just their beautiful voices. And I think it's a great way to make people, uh, you know, maybe restore a little bit more faith than you once had, you know, and, and, and if you, if you had faith before and it has diminished, maybe if you listen to something like this, it can restore your faith a little bit. Maybe, I don't know. It's on you. But it sure does bring up good memories where I went to church with my grandmother and I didn't hate it at all. I liked it. I went to Sunday school and everything. Very beautiful uh, song. One of the most pretty voices in this band. I love all of their voices. They're just so pristine. They're perfect. They're beautiful. It's just, it's nice to hear. It's nice to hear this a cappella band. And, you know, it's them bouncing off one another, uh, the bass in the background, you know, and it's just, just so remarkably pretty. It makes me feel, it makes me feel nice and makes me feel good. It makes me remember the people that I've lost. It, 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 it's hard because this is my grandma's, like one of my grandmother's favorite songs. So it's like, ugh. Yeah, I'm having a hard time here. <laughs> Mary, did you know that your baby boy would one day That sleeping child you're holding is the I just want to know how they didn't blow out those candles. Uh, Pentatonix. One remarkable band. Uh, it's, it's just a group of amazing souls that are not afraid to put out a religious song and cover it. It's, I've seen uh, The Sound of Silence by them and Hallelujah. That broke me. <laughs> that about broke me. Um, this one, too. You know, uh... It's a very, uh, I do my reactions with my emotion. I lead by emotion. And I'm not afraid to show my emotions. I'm not. It's just who I am. And uh, music has always been like this for me. I can remember when I was a child. Uh, you remember that song by Mr. Mr. Uh, broken Wings? Uh, you know, take these broken wings and learn to fly again. Learn to live so free. When I was a child, 
that would come on my the radio and I would scream at my mom, no, change it, change it. She wouldn't change it. And I would start bawling my eyes out because I thought it was about a broken bird, a, a bird with a, bro a broken pair of wings and it couldn't fly again. So music has always hit me on an emotional level and I just can't believe I remembered that. <laughs> wow. Um, it's okay. It's okay to show your emotions. It really is. This was magnificent. I love how they were in the cave and the beatboxing. And I didn't, I just thought he beatboxed. I didn't like pay attention or something to see that he actually could sing like that. Beautiful. S stellar. The stellar. Perfect. All right, there's more, I think. Oh, I downloaded that already. <clears throat> Mary, did you know that your baby boy would one day walk on water? Mary, did you know? That's awesome, man. Uh, what a great, what a great song. So you guys asked when I would do a uh, another pentatonix. There it is, and you know, I think that it's important that you do personalize music. You do take it personally, and you hold a special place in your heart and in your soul for the songs that touch you the most. Um, don't be ashamed of it either. I know there's like I, I've dealt with a lot of cultures uh, on this channel. Um, it's opened my eyes to so many, and I know some cultures you cannot show your emotions. I get it, but and you can in the privacy of your own home now, can't you? Yeah, that was uh, absolutely beautiful. So I get, thank you guys for suggesting it. I do listen to your suggestions. It just may take me a minute to get to it. Uh, I'm just Jen. This is me, man. <laughs> That's it. Like, I don't know what else to, you know, I don't know who else to be. And if you haven't hit that subscribe button, please do. I really want to get that silver play button. And I want to show my kids all of this hard work wasn't for nothing. All right, guys, take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Have faith. Yeah. I'm just Jen. See you guys. <laughs>